Hello, this is The Young Collector with another video. Today I'm going to be showcasing some of my government and uh, presidential related autographs. Um, this will not be including generals or military personnel because I'm going to be doing a separate um, video about my military related autographs. So without fur further ado, I will start off with W.M. Blumenthal, who is Secretary of Treasury for President Carter. Um, he signed my first day cover, and I got this one through the mail. He um, did not just, uh, he was not just a um, treasurer for Carter, but in 1939, he fled with his family from Germany to, um, to here in America, um, right before, um, the war, uh, broke out. Um, then we have a U.S. Senator, Richard S. Schweiker, I believe. Very German name. I have a signed, um, letter. This letter is from 1973. Um, I bought this at one of my stamp shops, and I actually first saw the envelope and thought it was interesting because it said U.S. Senate. And then um, when I got home, this fell out of it. And so let me quickly read it for you. Dear Mrs. Maloney, thank you for your, rec for your letter of uh, November 5th, expressing appreciation for my recent letter. There's no need to apologize for writing to me instead of Senator Weicker. The similarity between our names has often resulted in mail mix-ups between our offices. I am pleased to add your name to my mailing list and have enclosed a copy of my most recent newsletter for your review. Please let me know if you feel I can be of any further assistance. Thanks for writing. Best wishes, Richard S. Schwicker, U.S. Senator. And there is his signature. Okay. Then um, we are going to be... This is... Um, U.S. Grant Deities, the great-great-grandson of President and General Ulysses S. Grant. And in, I put it in the first day cover, is, is uh, this little note that he wrote on my self-addressed stamped envelopes. Uh, apologies for taking so long. <laughs> yeah, quite um, nice of him to do that because... Um, I still have stuff from, um, last year that has not gotten back to me. So, then this one, this one is quite special. It is signed, <laughs> signed by Mamie Eisenhower and David Eisenhower the second, um, or Dwight David Eisenhower the second. Um, I bought this at one of my stamp shops, um... And then I sent it to David Eisenhower, or Dwight David Eisenhower II, and also had him sign it. Um, I am probably going to get it signed by Dwight, David Eisenhower's wife, um, Linda Eisenhower Nixon, or Linda Nixon Eisenhower or something, um, who is the daughter of uh, pres former President Nixon. Uh, then we have this. This is one of my only TTM. This is um, in the presidential thing. This is my first day cover signed by President Bill Clinton, or former President Bill Clinton. Also got an index card signed by him. And then he sent me a note as well. Dear Aislinn, as you, uh, as you were requested, Keep up your interest in politics and history. Bill Clinton. And this is the only presidential item that I have that I got through the mail. Um, I'm not going to share the address for Clinton's privacy. And also because I forgot. <laughs> so um, then here we have one of my favorite items. This photograph signed by uh, former President Jimmy Carter. Um, there's Carter, um, right there. There is Bush Sr. And this is my aunt's 
father and my aunt she is native american i am not native american she married my uncle who i am related to but so her father worked with carter for native american uh, related bills and whatnot so but yeah that is my entire collection of presidential and and um, government related autographs hope you have a nice rest of your day and let your mailbox be full goodbye